Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Thank you for answering, Francisco. Welcome back. Welcome back, Francisco, Andrea, Ruben, and Jose Coreas. Thank you for being punctual. How was your day? How was your day? Today was a very stressful day. Really? Yes. Okay, a lot of work? A lot, a lot, a lot of. Okay, all right. Well, someone has to do it, you know. Okay, welcome back. What's today's date? Today is Wednesday. Um, Good Wednesday, what's the date? Yes. Six. Sixth, which month? Which month is it, people? April. April. So today is Wednesday, April 6th. The year 2022. July 22. 2022. That is correct. So we only have two more classes. Two more classes and we finalize basic six. Basic six, thank God. So, ya después quedan libres ustedes at eight o'clock. A las ocho de la noche ya pueden. You guys can return to your favorite TV program or you can return to your favorite people. You know, give me one second, please. Yes. Good evening. Good evening, Good evening. Carlos. Thank you for waiting. Okay, um, so yes, like I was saying, uh, once we're on vacation, you guys can return to uh, your favorite TV program, your favorite person, your favorite book and different things. All right, so today is um, April 6th, 2022. Do you remember the topics we spoke about yesterday? What were yesterday's topics? Mm -hmm. Anybody? 
que la tarea de ayer, Tichi. No, lo, las actividades que hicimos ayer. Ayer. Yesterday's activities. Did you? A yesterday. Did uh -huh. you request and where? Was, was and where? Was and where, yes. Was and where. Y en ese was and where estaba lo que estaba diciendo Juan That's Ricardo. The questions. Mm -hmm. And past Question. continues too. Now, can somebody tell me the differences between the simple past and past continuous? Dijo de simple. No, listen carefully. What are the differences between simple past and past continuous? Anybody? In past continuous, usamos was. Okay, y en simple past? De, el de. solo cambia el verbo. Not really. Sí, es cierto. Mm -hmm. cuando, cuando ocupamos el past continuous, we use was and were. And what is the form of the verb? Verb más ing. Okay, was were plus ing. I was cooking, we were practicing, she was driving. That's past continuous. And what's the function of the past continuous? To have, bear, and complement. What's the function of the past continuous? Anybody? Is the we doing in present? Past continuous. Past continuous. Ah, past, past. Get yeah, it no, or no did yeah, they did. ¿Cuál es, cuál es no. la función del past continuous, Juan Ricardo? Delgado. Que lleva de al final. No. 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 Hey, hey, no. Okay. Alguien, alguien más? What's the function of the past continuous? Lo que okay. hizo y continúa haciendo. Mm. Más o menos. No. Someone else, a little bit more concrete. Ah, que lleva T al final. No, Juan. No, no, no. Juan Ricardo. Perdón, uh -huh. perdón. <laughs> okay, someone else, what's the function of the past continuous? Mm. Lo ocupamos para hablar de acciones en progreso in a particular time in the past. Yo le pregunto, what were you doing today at 9 a.m.? ¿Qué le estoy preguntando ahí? What were you doing today at 9 a.m.? I was in English class. Okay, you were in English class. ¿Qué estoy haciendo ahora? Ala. ¿Qué estaba haciendo? ¿Qué estuvo ¿Qué haciendo? estaba haciendo ahora a las 9 a.m.? En la mañana, ajá. Ajá. Ah. What were you doing today at 9 a.m.? Somebody. Yes, I did wear it. To worry. A ver, ¿qué estuvieron haciendo a las nueve de la mañana? I was driving to my I was place. Driving. I was driving. I was driving. I was working. Was. I was working. 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 No, I was working, Juan Ricardo. Working. I was working. working. Yes. Working. So, um, past continuous, we're talking about an action in progress in a particular time in the past. Una acción que estaba en progreso en una hora en particular en tiempo pasado. That was the past continuous. The simple past, the simple past, we're talking about finished activities. Finished activities. Y el pasado simple también, it's finished already, but it was in progress in a particular time in the past. Es como diga usted, pues, que usted era teacher de matemática, digamos, en el pasado. Maybe. Ajá, en el pasado. Maybe, maybe. Ah, pues sí, entonces, o oh, algo que va, digamos, usted ha sacado profesorado de inglés, ¿va? y lo sacó en el pasado. Ajá, uh -huh. yes. That's the simple lo, past. Ahora estamos en el presente. 
continuo. No, en el presente simple estamos ahorita. Ajá, en el presente simple. O sea, es muy diferente. Va. Yes, they are es. different. Ajá, different. 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 Okay, anyways, any questions about yesterday? Questions about yesterday? No? Okay, so let's begin. Okay, share screen. Go here. Okay, so today we continue talking about the simple past. One topic in particular is about training. It says, we are on page 45. Estamos en la página 45, part one. When was the last time you attended a training? What was the training about? Can you give me examples of training? Anybody, can you give me examples of training? The use of computer. The use of computers, very good, thank you. What other training can you mention? ¿Qué entrenamientos puede usted mencionar de su, de, de, de su trabajo en general? ¿Qué clase de training le pueden dar? Eh, jardinería, uh -huh. gardening, albañilería, fontanería. Yes. Okay, someone else? Fontanería. Okay, alguien más? Food storage. Uh, one more time. Customer service. Customer service. Food storage. Practice. Okay, good storage practice. Yes. Okay. So I will give you five minutes para que usted le diga a su compañero o compañera cuando fue la última vez que usted agarró un training, una capacitación, a un entrenamiento y de qué se trataba. Give me a second. All right, let's go. Entonces, le vuelvo a repetir, van a discutir la última entrenamiento que ustedes agarraron y de qué se trató. Let's go.
Hello, William. Hello, teacher. How are you? I'm driving, teacher. Okay. William, do you have a question? Eh, sí, ¿cómo se dice, por ejemplo, yo pertenezco a la brigada de combate contra incendio? Uh, I, I, I belong to the fire extinction uh, br brigade. No, or fire. fire extinction team. Team is, 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 is acceptable too. Team. Yes, T-E-A-M, team. Yes. Okay. Any other questions? Uh, no, teacher. Okay, very good. Hola, no sé, no sé qué pasó. Hello, hello. Hello. How are you? Uh, I am uh, tired. ¿Cómo se dice? Tired. 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 Yes. I think everybody's tired at this time mm -hmm. of the day. Everybody's tired. Okay, let's wait for everybody to come back. One, two, five, six. Sí, faltan varios todavía que regresen. All right. So, when was the last training you guys took? Uh huh. When was the last training? I got water. Thank you. Tengo, tengo, tengo. Okay, when was the last training that you took? Uh, it's training fire extinction team. Okay, fire extension, good. Extinguición de fuegos, what else? Who else? ¿Quién más? The last year I had training in fire tail. First, first aid is very important. It's very, very important. Very good. Someone else? What was the last training you received? They gave you the food handling talk. The, 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 one more time, please. They gave you the food handling talk. Okay, food handling. Food handling, that's very important. Food handling, huh? Okay, food handling, what's the meaning of food handling, handling class? High attending. What's food handling? I attend. What is food handling? Food is comida. Como manipular la comida, yes. Food handling, food handling. Yeah. Handling. Food handling is very important. Si yo, les, very important. si yo les pregunto, levante la mano, ¿quién de ustedes comen? Todos la levantarían. That's a very, that's a very serious, that's a very serious uh, training. It's a very serious training. Yes. Okay. Um, anybody else? Todos tuvieron que haber tomado un training. Uh, Aunque sea al inicio de su, de su trabajo. What else? Un, co un, co un coffee. 
la the ruta de year, teacher. Excuse me. The last year I received training yeah, in public procurement. Public procurement. What's procurement? What's procurement? Eh, <coughs> compras, teacher. Purchases. Ah, uh, purchases. Purchases. Yes. Okay. Very good. Someone else? Quien más? Son, son. In, in 2016. Son. Okay, levante la mano. Yes, Francisco. In son. 2016, I had a training in Sonsonate on the use of Excel on a computer. Computer. Good. Excel is so important nowadays. Excel is yes. so important. Yes. Okay, anybody else? I train in the mm, you think? What question? What question, William? No, I train you for evacuation. Oh, evacuation. Yes, evacuation. Yo recibí uno de evacuación y cómo reaccionar ante un incendio like in December of last year. Yeah, they're very interesting. They're very okay. interesting. Okay, los que están callados nunca han recibido un training. De lo que sea. I oh, always been having training about sales. Good. Sales. That's where the money sale, is. Uh, how to uh, accept the change in the market. Okay. How to solve the problems in the market. Okay, fine, good. Uh, Rafael Antonio? In my case, teacher, um, my last training was a uh, year ago. It was about teamwork. Teamwork. Very good. Teamwork. Y hay gente que prefiere trabajar solo, pero muchas veces no es de que se puede escoger, sino que le dicen, mire, este va a ser su equipo con el que va a trabajar. So, teamwork. Is very necessary. Los otros no dieron capacitación de primeros auxilios una vez. Okay, por... tell me in English, Juan Ricardo. Uh, Dígame en inglés, Juan Ricardo. Uh, that is. Uh... Oh, espérame. No. Primeros auxilios, ¿cómo es ese uh, You tell me. Si es el mini. No, usted dígame, se dice first aid. First aid, no, pero no acordar bien. Ok, don't worry. Anybody else? ¿Alguien más que quiera compartir qué training le dieron la última vez? No. Somebody? Anybody? My last training was about, I don't know, who do you say, lavado de dinero? Uh, money laundry, money laundry, okay. money laundry, and about law and regulations. Okay, good, very good. You work in a bank, uh, Kenya? No, I am auditor. Oh, okay, all right, good. Okay, anybody else? Alguien más? Anybody else wants to share your training? I train it to BP, BPN. BPA. BPN. M. B BP. Buena, buena. Practica de manufactura. Okay. Very good. Good. Anybody else? Alguien más? Medication training. Good. Medication training. Yes. Anybody else? Okay, let's continue with the book. Go with this conversation. So like I told you at the beginning of the, of the session, we continue using, we continue practicing a simple past tense. So les voy a leer la, la, la conversación. I'm gonna read the conversation and then you guys practice, so pay attention. Hi, Julie, this is Jack. How are things going at work? Hello, Jack, everything is fine, thanks. How about you? Just perfect. 
Look, I want to know if you attended a training last year. We're sending the invitations for the new one. Yes, I did. The training I attended was about first aid and prevention. Sounds good. Where did it, where did it take place? It was held at the Crown Plaza Hotel. Do you recommend it? I mean, the training, did you find it helpful? Yes, absolutely. Most of us were pleased with the speakers and practices. I personally learned a lot. Questions or comments, people? Questions about pronunciation or meaning of vocabulary? Empieza Jack y le dice, hola, Yuli, te habla Jack. ¿Cómo van las cosas en el trabajo? Y le responde Yuli, hola, Jack, todo está bien, gracias. ¿Y vos? Ah, perfecto. Mira, quiero saber si fuiste a un training el año pasado. Estamos invitando, estamos enviando las invitaciones para el nuevo. Sí, sí fui. El training que yo fui estuvo, era de primeros auxilios y prevención. Suena bien. ¿Dónde tomó lugar? Tomó lugar en el Crown Plaza. ¿Lo recomiendas? Quiero decir, el, el, el training. ¿Lo encontraste útil? Sí, absolutamente. La mayoría de nosotros estuvimos complacidos con los presentadores y las prácticas. Personalmente, aprendí mucho. Questions or comments? Go ahead, teacher. Excuse me? Go ahead. Where? Where is that word? I understand. Oh, you understand everything? Yes. Excellent. Very good, Moises. Anybody else? Any questions or comments? Rafa, ¿qué está lo que yo le dije que habíamos aprendido, teacher? Ajá. Attended but the bad fishes a prevention. Okay, good. Very good. All right. So we're going to practice the conversation. One of you guys is going to be Jack. The other one is going to be Julie. When you finish, you change positions. And... De una vez va a, ten, va a responder las tres preguntas que están en la parte tres. So, part two is to practice your conversation. And part three is to answer the questions. Give me a second. 19 people at a room. Okay, recreate. Recreate. One second. I agree. I agree. Okay, let's go. Pronunciation and reading comprehension. We are going to practice the, the conversation, conversation and then answer the questions. Yes, sir. You're right. Thanks. Send me to the group, please. <laughs> yes, I did. Uh, I lost the the connection that I want to. Okay. Do you have the invitation uh, for group number nine, Carlos?
Hello, hello. Buenas noches, teacher. How are you, Reina? I'm fine, teacher. Are you practicing with Juan Ricardo? Eh, fíjese que dice que aún va manejando, teacher, pero que ya está por llegar a casa. Okay, very good. Thank you. O es pre, prevención, ¿verdad? Así ¿Dónde sería. Dice prevention. Pre, ah, prevention. Sería entonces. Yo prevención digo. Dice, hi, Judy. Dice, ya. Hi, Judy. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Are you practicing? Yes. Okay. Ya, ya habíamos practicado respondiendo, estábamos. Okay, Después very de... good. Okay, very good. Hello, Iris and Ana Mercedes. Hi, teacher. How are que, you? Eh, uh -huh. uh, tan, cansada, teacher. Mira, a ver si me ha tocado. Bien pesado. Me imagino. <ríe> Dice que la compañera Iris este, tiene problemas porque como que va de camino. Sí, así, así nos ah. comentó en el chat. Está bien. Uh -huh. Ya casi nos regresamos. Sí, aquí estaba practicando. Ok, very good. Thank you, Ana Mercedes. Ok.
Hello, people. Teacher, how do you feel first aid or eyes? Aid. 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 Yes, first aid. Okay, okay. Yep. Let's ver. Okay, two seconds, one second. Okay. Raise your hand if you know how to swim. Raise your hand if you know how to swim. ¿Qué le digo ahí? Que levantemos la mano si no podemos nadar, creo. Si pueden nadar. Sí. Uh -huh. Raise your hand if you can swim. Ah, vamos a ver quién más puede nadar. Ok. All right. De los que han levantado la mano... ¿Puede usted rescatar a alguien que se está ahogando? Yo no, no puedo. Teacher. Yo puedo no. nadar, pero yo no puedo rescatar a nadie. No. No, teacher. Oh. Ok. All right. ¿Moisés? No, teacher. No. Ok, mire, y, y uh, la cuestión es de que usted está viendo que está ahogando un, un familiar suyo. Su instinto, le se, usted se tira al agua. Pero si no anda abuso, los dos se van. También una vez en un estero rescaté a mi hermano. Estábamos ahí en el agua y los fango y una corriente lo jaló. Y entonces me metí a sacarlo y, y también me sacaron a mí después. Yeah. Yeah. Pero hicimos la acción. Sí, sí, sí. Exacto. Ok, muy bien. Teacher. Yes, sir. I think that uh, we will go to uh, the beach. <laughs> now, we should, we could. Yeah. Ya que viene la vacación. Hay que hacer el paso más grande. <laughs> okay, so question one says, what type of training did Julie attend? What kind of training? It was about first aid and prevention. Very good. It was about first aid and prevention. Did she find the training of great help? Yes, she did. Yes, she did. Very good. In your opinion, how often should trainings take place? Japan. For oh, me, I, at, I, 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 okay, I, raise your hand, raise your hand, levante la mano, okay, raise your hand, raise your hand. Para no tener... Depends, depends on the apply of training. Okay, Carmen Calderon? Twice a year, teacher. Twice a year, Judy Cuellar? I think every six months. Every six months. Okay, good. Y en sus compañías hacen a... Um, ¿Cómo se le llama esto? Drills. Simulacro. Simulacros, exactly. Thank you. Hacen simulacros en sus lugares de trabajo. Yes, yes teacher. Good, very I good. Know. Antes se encargaba el equipo de, de seguridad ocupacional de hacer todos los tipos de capacitaciones para las empresas. Ok. All right. Yes. ¿Cómo digo de incendio y terremoto? Fire and earthquake. Ahorita se lo voy a poner. Fire and earthquake. Fire and earthquake. Fire, fire or worker. Fire and earthquake. Earthquake. Fire and earthquake. Incendio y terremoto. 
Anybody else? Any other questions or comments? Not quite. Okay. Vamos a pasar lista. Let's take attendance. Okay. I'm going to put you in silent. A todo lo voy a poner en silencio. La persona que voy nombrando me va diciendo present. Alex Martínez. Alex Martínez. Absent. Francisco Godínez. Present. Delmi Gómez. Present. Kenia Ruiz. Present, teacher. Juan Delgado. Present, teacher. Good. William Pérez. Present. Good. Susana Jiménez. Susana Jiménez. José Corea. Present. Uh, Judy Cuellar. Present, teacher. Good, good. Carlos Avendaño. Present, teacher. Elsa Merino. Elsa Merino. Absent. Noemi Vasquez. Oh, she's having connection problems. Ah, uh, Lisette Paz. Ruben Campos. Present, teacher. Good. Helen Barraza. I'm here, teacher. Good. Moises Rodriguez. Present. Maricela Velasquez. Present, teacher. No, me dio una, me quería tomar ahorita por el gran calor que trae. Present, teacher. Thank you, thank you. Okay, uh, Rafa Barrientos. Present. Good. Iris Cañas. Iris, Iris. Okay, uh, Reina Martinez. Present, teacher. Good. Juan Ricardo Alvarenga. Present, teacher. Good. Carmen Calderón. Present, teacher. Andrea Vázquez. I'm here. Good. And Ana Mercedes Amaya. Present. Very good. Thank you. Let's continue. Ya solo nos va quedando una hora de clase. Don't worry. Don't worry. Okay. Um, all right. So um, part four, it says, imagine you attended two of these meet trainings. Express why you would recommend them. Entonces tenemos cuatro clases de training. Usted, uh, imagínese que, aten, que usted llegó a dos de ellos. What is the first one? Anger management. Anger management. ¿Cómo controlar a uh, nuestro enojo? Anger management. Y eso es muy importante. Customer service. What's customer service? Servicio al cliente. Servicio Ajá. al cliente. Telephone etiquette. Telephone etiquette. ¿Qué dice ahí? ¿Qué dice ahí? Telephone etiquette. La sección. La sección. Podría aplicar para un puesto de recepción. Yes. Telephone mm -hmm. etiquette. Etiqueta de teléfono en first aid training. First aid training. What's the meaning of first aid? Primeros auxilios. Exactly, primeros auxilios. Entonces ahí le dan el ejemplo. Si digamos usted agarró el anger management, usted va a decir, I highly recommend this training because he helped me control my emotions. Al agarrar el anger management, pues eh, le ayudó a esta persona a controlar sus emociones. Entonces usted va a hacer de caso que ha participado en dos de ellos. 
y tiene que explicar por qué los recomienda. Questions or comments? Mm, no me he quedado claro, teacher. Ok. ¿Cuántas options tenemos? We got four. Anger management, oh. customer service, telephone etiquette, and first aid training. Usted va a hacer de caso que ha asistido a dos de ellas y va a explicar por qué las recomienda. ¿Me explico? ¿Esto sería como en la vida real o...? o... Sí, sí. A real life uh, scenario. Control del enojo, atención al cliente, etiqueta de teléfono y primeros auxilios. Y si de verdad ya los tomó en la vida real, pues explique por qué le lo recomienda. ¿Estamos bien? ¿Are the instructions clear? ¿Están bien las instrucciones, people? Yes, teacher. Yes, go teacher. ahead. Go ahead. Two more minutes, two more minutes. All right, volunteer to explain 
uh, the trainings that you're mentioning? Anybody? ¿Cuál de los cuatro, cuál dos de los cuatro considera más importantes? Which ones do you consider the most important? Number one. Number one. Number two, customer service. Okay. Number two. Okay, number two. Anybody customer else? service. Number okay. four. Four. First aid training. Yeah. Yeah, yo creo que el cuatro es el más uh, relevant. Porque estamos hablando yes. de salvar la vida de una persona. Yes. Yeah. In the field training. Yeah, first aid training because one, two, and three, they help us to be better workers. But number four, we are prepared to save another person's life. And that is extremely important. Okay, questions or comments. Why do you consider first aid to be uh, the most important? Why do you? Because if it helps you how you how to react in case of an emer em emerging emergency. emergency. Yes, very good. It helps you prepare how to react in, on a real emergency. Yes. And when we're talking about emergency, sometimes those emergencies are uh, life or death. Son de vida o muerte. Life or death. Yep. Okay. Uh, what about customer service? ¿Usted cree que customer service uh, o ha tomado usted de customer service? ¿Por qué lo recomendaría? Que empiece esa atención al cliente. In my case. No, más que este o oh. Cuando uno va me da una recomendación a Okay, a can you, Okay, can you tell us in English, Juan Ricardo? In my case, teacher. Uh -huh. Yes, Judy. Uh -huh. Yes. Judy. Because it is very important when making a sale. Making a sale. A sale. A sale. What's the meaning of vendors. oh sales sales yes sales sales are very important yes all right Brian, anybody else Brian my uh, recommend you a uh, word uh, custo service or fish training okay uh, okay anybody else. Customer yes. service help uh, give you the knowledge maybe how to deal with people. Yes, yes, it tells you how to deal with people exactly, and knowing how to deal with people is very important. What about you, tell me? You raise your hand. And customer service. I highly recommend this training because I learned how to communicate in a correct way with clients. So they don't and provide recommendations. Good, very good. Anybody else? This is the preview. What's the meaning of preview? ¿Qué significa preview? Preview. Not really. Preview. Preview. Uh huh. What's the meaning of preview? I see uh, it in the chat. Preview. Es la antesala. ¿Qué es una antesala? What's the meaning of antesala? Adelanto. Avance. Un adelanto, un avance, correcto. Ah. Uh, so this is the preview. Look, un trailer. Okay, un trailer. <laughs> yeah. Um, 
este es un preview de lo que vamos a hacer en la siguiente actividad. So, por eso quiero que me digan qué, qué es lo que ustedes piensan. Questions or comments about number four. No. Ok, entonces aquí lo vamos a hacer de manera escrita. Dice la parte 5. Write an email recommending a workshop or training course and providing information about it. Entonces usted tiene que decidir a quién se lo va a enviar. Ahí tiene que poner su correo. Subject. What's the meaning of subject? La parte 3 de la número 5. Ajá. What's the meaning of subject? Es como el... Uh, el asunto. asunto. El asunto. Very good. Very good. Entonces, usted va a decidir a quién se lo va a enviar. Va a poner su correo. Y en el asunto, usted le va a poner a uh, recomendaciones de un training, whatever. Y en el espacio grande, ahí lo va a poner a uh, la descripción. Obviamente, pues lo va a hacer, en, lo puede hacer en el libro, si ya lo tiene impreso, si ya, o lo hace en el cuaderno. Como se sienta usted mejor. Hay gente que no le gusta manchar los libros. Yo sí escribo los libros, pero hay gente que no le gusta hacerlo. Así que, uh, you choose. Entonces, uh, any questions about this activity? No? Not okay. Teacher. All right. Go ahead.
You guys ready? Okay, five more minutes, five more minutes. Lo vamos a copiar al chat. No, lo, lo van a, a compartir en, en parejas. It's going to be pair work. Perfect. Two more minutes, two more minutes.
All right, let's do the practice. So I'm going to ask you to work in pairs. Va a trabajar en pareja. Usted le va a enseñar el correo donde usted está recomendando X training y su compañero o compañera va a hacer lo mismo. A lo cual usted debe de responder al correo. Me explico. So, si estuviese trabajando con Carlos Avendaño, Carlos Avendaño me va a mandar su correo a uh, el por qué está recomendando X training. Yo también voy a hacer lo mismo. Carlos va a responder mi correo y yo voy a responderle a él también. Are the instructions clear? ¿Estamos bien? Clear, teacher. Ok, give me a second. I have a question, teacher. Yes, ask me. Eh, subject, dijimos que era asunto. Eh, sí, correcto. Y en ese asunto es como el tema, ¿verdad? Correcto, así es. Eh, ahí voy a poner... Eh, Recommendation de... of training. Ajá. Y por ejemplo, pongo primer auxilio, ¿verdad? Que first aid siempre tiene que ser en mayúscula. Uh, yes, first aid, exactly. Okay. That is correct. So let me see this here. And she's going to work here. All right, let me check the rest of the pairs. All right, we're ready. Let's go. Francisco in Kenya.
Ủa lên Hello, hello Hello Give me a second I have problem with my senior Okay, you're Maricela. Yes. Okay, give me a second. Right there. I'm sending you to room three. Classroom three.
All right, any questions or comments about uh, the exercise you just finished? No? Okay, so I'm gonna mention the names of the people that were absent the first time that I took attendance. Uh, Iris Cañas, are you here? Okay, she's absent. Alex Martinez, are you here? Iris Cañas parece que dijo que andaba fuera de San Salvador y que iba a estar solo de oyente. Ok, thank you. Uh, Susana Jiménez. Vale, entonces a qué hora? Elsa Merino. Elsa Merino. Uh, Noemi Vázquez. She asked for permission. Um, and that's it. All right. Como le vuelvo a repetir, solamente estaba mencionando los que no me, los que no me contestaron the first time. Okay, so let's go to our next activity. I'm going to send you a link. The link, the, the video is like two minutes, I think. And the link is about how people use music in the simple past tense. Give me a second. Probablemente ya he escuchado algunas de esas canciones, probablemente no. And here we go. Click on the video, please. Click on the video. Póngalo uno, teacher. Perdón. Pónganos una music. De... Ahí está el link, ahí está el link. Ahí está el link. Teacher, the same Zoom chat, please. Okay, let me check if I can send it. Give me a second. I should be able. Okay, well, we're in, we're in. Copy. Paste. Ahí les va. Ahí va. Ahí está también en el Zoom chat. Go ahead. You wear my...
Very interesting. One more minute, people. One more minute. Los que están trabajando y el audio. All right, any questions or comments about that video? Maybe you recognize some of the songs, maybe you didn't. At the end, the message is, you know, that's how people use the simple past in a real life uh, situation, right? Questions or comments? Oh, very interesting. Yep, yep, yeah. I would like to Se oye, se oye como que están escuchando un partido ahí Juan Ricardo Alvarenga. No, me gustaría recomendarles a los compañeros que practiquen su um, speaking. Ajá. Eh, escuchando música en inglés y pues, leyendo la letra a la misma vez. Yo así. Ya, ya. Practiqué bastante y me ha servido mucho. Ya, yeah. it works for many people. Mucha gente que la música le sirve de mucho, de mucho apoyo. For pronunciation y con no, todo. Así también. Good, very good. Y se le hace más efectivo si pone a su favorite singer. Ah, dice los virus, me gustan los virus, puede poner los lyrics. Oh, me gusta The Police, pone The Police, Air Supply, tantos grupos uh, that you can activate the, uh, uh, the lyrics. Notification, yeah. Good. Because I used to practice just with, uh, for all songs, the canciones viejitas, así que son un poco más tranquilas, donde uno puede ir. Pues, escuchando y leyendo la, 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 la letra a la, a la misma vez. Exactly. Exactly. Very good. Okay. So, let's go to our last activity. Give me a second. Ta -da -da. Okay. It's right here. So, el último va a ser de lectura. The last activity. Read the following invitation letter for a training and answer the questions below. Lo lee y después de haber leído y entendido lo que están diciendo, you answer these questions. Got it? Are the instructions clear? Okay, léalo. If you have questions, you let me know. There all you.
All right, people, we're gonna continue with this activity tomorrow. Um, any questions or comments? I read your messages uh, on WhatsApp about the answer, de que la ponen tal como se las compartí, aún así no se la recibe, no se la lee. So I'm going to report that to my supervisor. ¿Quién se va a quedar ahora conmigo? No me acuerdo quién fue que prometió. All right, sí. Okay, so everybody, have a good night. Ya solo nos quedan dos clases. Terminamos el libro mañana. El viernes hacemos la, la encuesta y el final exam too. So, have a good night. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Jose Corea? Yes. How are you? I'm fine. Good, good. Work. <laughs> okay, what time do you finish work? Uh, tomorrow at 6 a.m. Okay, good. And, and where do you work again? What's the name of the company? Uh, I work at ICE. Guys. Oh, okay. What branch? Are you Tuxtepeque? No? Yes, yes. Okay, good, good. Okay, Jose Coreas, do you have any questions about the classes I have been teaching? No, oh, I feel you can teach. Very good. Okay, very good. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so if you don't have any questions or comments, I'll be seeing you tomorrow. Oh, okay, okay. Thank have you. a good night. Bye bye. Have a good night. Bye. Thank you.